Hey guys, welcome back to Clownfish TV. This is Neon, not here with Geeky Sparkles in this video, but we're gonna talk about The Simpsons and how you can't choke a kid on TV anymore. Man, what kind of what kind of politically correct world are we living in when you can't choke an eight-year-old cartoon character on screen anymore? Because Disney owns The Simpsons, they're getting rid of Homer choking Bart. Now, Homer has been choking Bart for 35 years, which might explain why he's still in the fourth grade or third grade after all this time, right? Uh, lack of blood flow to the brain or something. So apparently Disney doesn't uh, think it's very funny to uh, physically assault children. And yeah, just... We're gonna, we're gonna leave it at that. We're gonna talk about this. Before we get into it any further, please subscribe for more pop culture news, views, and rants, guys. Uh, go out to shopclownfish.com, uh, back Shadowbinders Volume 3, shipping next summer, just so you know, this is a pre-order, a pre-order for a hardcover graphic novel. Uh, first new Shadowbinders content in like 10 years. We still have uh, some copies of one and two. I'm not sure if we're going to go back to press or not. We'll, we'll we'll see. We'll see where we're at. We'll see what the demand is. But we definitely want to get the third volume out the door anyway. Uh, so this is coming from TMZ. They got a version here in the New York Post. Uh, Simpsons, Homer stops strangling Bart. Times have changed. Times have changed. Uh, Homer Simpson is done strangling his son Bart. And it all has to do with modern sentiments. It seems a decision by showrunners that's strongly dividing fans. Now, uh, The Simpsons hasn't been good in about 25 years. <laughs> I'm going to be honest, but it's gotten significantly worse and a lot more politically correct since Disney got their hands on it. Uh, you know, they keep changing voice actors. They keep toning down the jokes because, you know, we can't be funny. We can't be offensive. Uh, Disney doesn't want to offend anyone. And apparently uh, there are some kids that uh, uh, feel it's not very funny to to see Bart get strangled or some people. I mean, look, it never really was funny. There's a whole episode about it, if I remember correctly, about uh, Homer choking Bart, but they are cartoon characters. Let's remember at the end of the day, they are cartoon characters. You know, so what's next? Uh, uh, Kenny's not going to be able to die on South Park, even though he is a cartoon character. The pivot away from child abuse, albeit in animated form, is just now making the rounds, coming to in the third episode of season 35, titled McMansion and Wife, in which Homer Simpson meets his, meets his new neighbor and declares he won't be choking his cartoon son anymore. The way this becomes revealed is through a handshake, which the neighbor points out as firm, and then Homer responds, see Marge strangling the boy pay off. Then he follows up and says, just kidding, I don't do that anymore. Times have changed. At least they're aware. It's kind of like a poo. They talk about how they don't talk about some characters anymore, and, and uh, Lisa put the picture of a poo in her drawer or something. I'm trying to remember how they dealt with it on the show. But basically, Apu is problematic now because of this documentary. I think it was called The Problem with Apu and the fact that a white guy was voicing Apu. And he decided on his own, as I understand it, he decided he didn't want the hassle. He wasn't going to voice Apu anymore. And they basically, I think they retired the character. Like, I don't think Apu's on the show at all anymore. Um, I don't know. They were talking about recasting him with an actual Indian actor. But uh, I don't know what's going on there. Um, cause I'll watch it cause the Simpsons sucks. It sucks. And Disney Simpsons is awful. Uh, it really is. Uh, I, but I mean, as far as the Simpsons itself, the show had 10, maybe 12 good seasons, fantastic seasons, some, like almost all the classic Simpsons references come from those first, that first decade. And after that, it's just been downhill, you know, just just freaking end it. Just, <laughs> just end the Simpsons already, right? Uh, fans took this to be a not so subtle hint that Disney, which owns the Simpsons IP now, uh, they're retiring the long running gag, which has been a staple joke for years. Before this episode, the new masters of the Simpsons had actually already toyed with the idea of Homer evolving and refraining from strangling Bart with season 22 featuring Homer going to therapy and learning the harm he was causing by attacking his son. That's true. I do remember there being um, some talk about that. In the season since, Homer has choked Bart on and off, and the last time he did it in the show was back in 2019, 2020. Now, however, it seems like the creators are acknowledging it's over for good. Of course, with Homer hanging up his strangling ways, there's some pushback with a handful of folks saying that The Simpsons has gone woke. Others are praising it. Uh, show some examples. They're not showing some examples. So let's go out to the, the New York Post, which actually shows uh, some examples. Um... 
I just found out that after 30 years, The Simpsons has finally retired their long-running gag of Homer strangling Bart, says Baby Lamb. Took them long enough. I knew my man Homer was going to learn. Uh, <laughs> two people, two people. Uh, so they talk about the, the uh, trouble with the poo. Or the problem with the poo? The problem with the poo? The problem with the poo is white guy voices him, not trendy in 2020. Let's see what the comments are here on the New York Post. Uh, yes, because Bugs and Elmer made me the psycho I am today. They took the guns away from Elmer Fudd in the new Looney Tunes on uh, HBO Max, if I remember correctly. So, yeah. I mean, this is where we're at right now. Tom and Jerry, they got to hug it out. Itchy and scratchy. I guess they can't kill each other anymore. I don't know. Can they still kill each other? They're... The cartoon, cartoon animals. Uh, anything after 2002 is unfunny, pretend Simpsons, and should be ignored. Anyway, I agree 100%. Uh, I think that uh, after the first 10 or 12 seasons, I think that would put us in like, was it like season 13? When did it come on? 89? Anything after the first 10 or 12 seasons is garbage. Homer goes woke. The Simpsons will suck even more than it has for the last 25 years. Thank you, Mitchell. It's a cartoon. If you look at all the cartoons from the past, most have some types of violence. Ask the Roadrunner. Ask Bugs Bunny. On the other hand, you have Betty Boop, a sex symbol for six-year-olds. Uh, yeah, and they've got uh, some stuff going on in like Blue's Clues and stuff now too, which is kind of like, wait, that's a little little much for a six-year-old, five-year-old, three-year-old. Uh, my behavior from childhood to young adulthood was directly influenced by cartoons. It isn't fair to expect everyone to understand that cartoons and reality aren't the same. Wait, wait, what? It isn't fair to expect everyone to understand that cartoons and reality aren't the same thing, so we should all pretend that cartoons portraying slapstick humor never existed. After many years of therapy, I now know it's wrong to drop an anvil on someone while wearing rocket-powered roller skates. Thank you, Warner Brothers, for ruining the best years of my life. The death of humor. Well, knowing Homer Simpson and Bart, the promise won't last long. Anybody who's got adult kids, oh no, anybody who's got kids could tell you that. I wish modern writers would learn to proofread their work. Homer is the patriarch, not the matriarch of the family. Right. Storyline idea. Homer trains in jujitsu, puts Bart in a chokehold. What does it matter? It hasn't been good for 20 years. I agree. Jerk Diggler, I agree. I'm a giant Simpsons fan. I've generally disliked or at least rolled my eyes at the changes they made in recent years. Blame Disney. But I never found the strangling Bart gag funny and I am fine with this. Could be fatal if you have malformed arteries. It's a cartoon. They're not real people. <laughs> the matriarch of the Simpson family was back to his old ways. Uh, yeah, that might have been a Freudian slip. Stopped watching years ago. Go Futurama on Hulu. Um, I don't know. Is that allowed to be funny now? Is uh, Futurama allowed to be funny? So here, here's a thing, which I, I just found out fairly recently. And it, it's weird. My son actually uh, pointed this out to me. That Marge was supposed to be a rabbit originally. And uh, this was uh, Matt Groening's Life in Hell strip with the, the one-eared rabbit, right? She was supposed to be one of the rabbit people. And the reason she had the beehive hairdo and originally was that she had rabbit ears underneath the wig. It was supposed to be a wig. And the only remnant you see of this, I guess, is in the Simpsons arcade game when she gets electrocuted. And it's weird because I'm a huge arcade fan, arcade game fan. And... I'm a huge animation fan, and it's actually the, the first time I heard it was a couple of years ago from my son, who I guess saw a TikTok on or something. He's like, yeah, the, if you look at Marge when she gets electrocuted, she's got rabbit ears because she was supposed to be a rabbit. And then the other writers told Matt Groening he was like smoking something, and that was stupid, and that would never work on The Simpsons. But they were going to hold the, the rabbit ear joke until the very last episode, I guess, and they didn't think the thing would go on for 35 years. But clearly she's not a rabbit. I don't even know how that would work. Uh, Homer was also supposed to be crusty too. So, you know, <laughs> which explains a lot because he literally just looks like Krusty the Clown. But anyway, I'm going to wrap this one up. There we go, guys. Uh, Disney destroying the Simpsons again. Uh, I cannot wait until they cancel this show because it doesn't matter if it goes on forever. Honestly, like I said, the only episodes of the Simpsons I care about are like those first 10, 12 years. Uh, anything after that, if I see it widescreen, I'm like, yeah, I'm, I'm out. I don't care. If it's in widescreen, it's like, yeah, it's probably not going to be any good. It's not going to be any good. So I'm going to wrap it up. Please subscribe for more pop culture news, views, and rants, and we'll talk later.